Welcome to the flash of Center Global News with the most important in the union, academic and educational field. Let's go to the information. The National Union of Education Workers and the California Teachers Association agreed to look after the immigrant students at the borderline between Mexico and the United States so they can continue their education regardless their nationality, gender or ethnicity. Noticing that the world should combine forces for an inclusive education, schools without borders, the construction of bridges of understanding and of walls that generates division for being social justice covering topics. The program completes the elaboration of educational contents, a protocol that brings elements to teachers about how to act with their students. The Centro UNESCO Guide for Indigenous Education Teachers, the Teaching of English, the Reciprocal Visits to Schools and the Exchange of Teachers for Brief Residence. During the encounter, the General Secretary of the CENTE, Alfonso Cepeda Salas, and the President of the CTA, Eric Hines, both agreed that just as in the border of North America, in the world, public schools have the obligation of receiving these children and young immigrants despite the absence of academic or identity documentation, since education is a universal right and not a privilege of a few. It is also important to point out that the California Teachers Association represents 360,000 workers from public universities and public schools, which belongs at the same time to the National Education Association, the biggest educational organization in the United States, with 3 million members. Meanwhile, the CENTE counts with a little few more than 2 million and a half members and it's an active member of the Education International, that can gather in 30 million of educational workers that are bound together in 460 unions of 197 countries around the five continents. Teresa Lopez Lorian, Center News. Thank you. I'm Jorge Boyoli. This was Center Global News. And right here and now, you are informed.